Hey guys, welcome back to another video. iOS 18 has just been released and it's packed with exciting new features and some of the standard features include redesigned control center features and enhanced customization options for the home screen and much more. However, as with any beta release, there are bound to be some bugs and issues. Many users have reported problems like download stuck, failed installations, devices not working or turning on, overheating and apps crashing issues. If you have experienced any of these issues and want to go back to iOS 17, don't worry, we have got you covered. You can easily downgrade your iPhone, iPad using Tenorshare Reiboot. Check the link in the description below to get started with Tenorshare Reiboot. Tenorshare Reiboot is a powerful tool designed to help you solve various iOS and iPad OS issues. From fixing stuck downloads to restoring your device to a previous version, Reiboot has got you covered. But first, make sure to back up your data. We highly recommend using Tenorshare iCare phone for a seamless backup experience. And currently they have a special promotion where you can purchase Reiboot and iCare phone together for only $29.95. It's a great deal compared to purchasing each product separately. So here is the software interface. It can repair 150 plus iOS issues like stuck on Apple logo and black screen etc. And with this you can also enter and exit recovery mode just by clicking on a button. And in today's video we are focusing on iOS downgrade. Choose this option. And if you have any secondary device and you want to experience iOS 18, you can also upgrade your iPhone to iOS 18. And to downgrade iOS 18 to iOS 17, choose the downgrade option. And here you can see my phone model iOS version. It's currently 18.0. And here you need to download the firmware. Choose the location where you want to save the firmware and click on initiating downgrade. And it will start downloading the firmware package. Wait for the firmware package to be downloaded. It will take some time due to about 7 GP firmware package. Once the firmware package is downloaded on your computer, click initiating downgrade. After you downgrade to previous version, you are going to lose the data on your iPhone. Therefore, the first thing you have to do is to back up the data on the device. You can use Tenorshare iCare phone to back up your device. And after downgrading, you can easily recover the data when you are done with downgrading the OS. So click on continue. It will start the deep downgrading process. The whole process will take a few minutes and your device will be restored to iOS 17. And that's it, your iPhone or iPad is now back to iOS 17. So if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech tips and updates. And thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.